Chop it. Quick. Hurry. Fast. Do it. Now. Before I die. Oh, shit. Ah. Welcome back, everybody, to Entrouted. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, uh, we are going to uh, do some questing here for the farmer. Uh, she needs a kettle so we can she can make herself a cooking fire so she can make us some pretty good food. Uh, so that is the plan. Stan, um, fireplace for the farmer is what we got. Uh, where is that on the map? It is ooh, that's quite a ways uh, quite a ways up there. Um, we don't have anywhere nearby. I think what I'm going to do is let's pull. Oh, I don't think we need this one here anymore. So let's go to here. We'll p pick that one up and then we'll just work our way over to the new location. Um, I picked I, I picked the other shrine up uh, or I, I'm sorry, a flame altar that was over by um the last spire that we did too over to the to the east there um so that'll give us two plus we have another quest that will when we complete it give us the wyvern head which we need to upgrade the flame again and once i get that the only thing other thing i need is amber and i don't know how to get amber I've run across it once or twice just lying on the ground, but I don't know how to get it in quantity. So I'm going to have to figure that out. Uh, if I can't, you know, if I can't just figure it out, I'll I'll probably have to look it up. But I'd like to I'd like to try and figure it out first. Um, I, like I said, I haven't... I've just found a piece here and there lying on the ground, but that's it. So uh, I need lots of flax, too, because I need to make more... That's just clay. I need to make more uh, linen as well. Let's go to the map here. And we've already... Have we done that elixir well? We haven't. Okay, why don't we work our way to this elixir well, do it, and then we'll cross up here and and do that. So let's, let's get her done. Okay, let's take our buff food before we head down into the muckety muck. And hopefully after this episode we'll have the the better buff food. Um I think I'm gonna hold off on that stuff for now. Alright, here we go. Clover Brook Farm. Oh, Crap. Um, we have increased damage against flying monsters now, which is good. Let's get rid of her first, and then we'll worry about the guy on the ground. Okay. It's a level 13. Got him. Alright, we got a an orb from that dude. Stay away from that muckety muck. Okay, I don't I don't think I want to spend a bunch of time here. Let's just move on. Get out of here, bugs. Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, another another bad guy stuck in the mesh. Good lord, he hits hard. Look how much health he took down. Crap. Ouchies. I got combat music coming from somewhere, but I don't know where it's coming from. Wait, what the? What the hell, man? Um, going the wrong way. White wind. Oh, never mind. Oh shit. 
this is a uh, a different town with bugs all over in it. Let's just leave them behind. I thought that was the same town I just came from, and I had you know backtracked somehow. Uh, yeah, we don't want to go on that stuff. A little bit of backstab damage in. You know what? I was going to make some more arrows, too. Uh, Alright, how do we get across this crap? Not going that way. I might be able to make... Hmm, can I make that? If I can't make it, we'll be in a world of hurt. Oh, looks like there might be... ...a passage back this way. Hey! Don't do that. It's rude. There's a dock over there, but I... I don't know if it's gonna, um... Be far enough to get me around. Let's go get the orb here. No, that's not really going to help much, is it? Okay. Well, I think, um, you guys just don't want to leave me alone. What was that? This is high enough to where I think I can make it across. If we don't, then we die. That's all there is to it. There we go. Okay, we're good. Let's keep moving. We need to go this way. I like the sword. Okay, I'm starting to get a little bit concerned about our time here in the shroud. Um, can we get out and refresh? Boy, it doesn't look much like it, huh? Well, actually, right here, right, uh, right here. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, if we just hold still, quit jumping around like a maniac here, we'll be fine. Am I too close to the edge there? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so this refreshes us. Um... I think I'm going to, yeah, let's use that. And let's throw one of these out too, just so we can see a little bit better. All right, we gotta go this way. Thing is, those, I, hmm, I don't know if the glowing orb is actually helping a whole lot because it's so cloudy here. Still, really hard to figure out where to go. Almost wondering if maybe I shouldn't have stayed on the other side. Oh, here we go. We got a bridge of some sort over here. Oh, got one of them guys. Is there any...
Let's refresh this and this and that. Ooh! Oh. Nope, wrong toolbar. Okay, this is kind of a, a bad spot to be in. I'm trying to jump over those things. Not doing a very good job of it, though. Alright, I'm going to take a potion this time. I bet you that'll get us up high enough to get out of the shroud for a second. Yes, it does. Okay, good. Whew. Um, all right. Uh, let's see. Where are we? So we're we're just crossing a bridge, but we need to go north after we get to the other side. Top off our health here. Is there anything on this bridge? All right, let's. Uh, this seems to be heading in the right direction here. think. Yep, that's it right there. Okay, there's a potion. Let's not take it quite yet, though. Because if we can get to... What's this say? By the ancients, during last week's rainstorm, my own eyes gazed upon a sight most mystifying. A hooded figure on the road to Glenwood's end with the look of a specter. Did they float above the ground, or has memory betrayed me? Okay, good. That's what I was... Whoa, shit! Looking for this thing right here. I didn't remember to get... Tough man. Level 15. There's something over here too. Can't s can't really see it very well. There we go. And something here. How many arrows do I have left? 66. Crap. We need to save these for whatever boss we're gonna have to fight. Let's get rid of you, and that way we're not stepping in that shit, and you too. Alright, we'll loot this stuff. Took me a second to figure out what that was, it's just a dead guy. All right, so we have nine minutes in the shroud, but I'm probably going to pop one of these. But I'll, I'm going to hold off on that until until we get down and figure out what it is we got to deal with. 
question is, where do we go? It's so damn hard to see. Um... Do we go? Hmm. Oh, we must go down this way. Okay. One's a long way down. Okay, again, I want to try and conserve my arrows. Oh shit, we didn't need that to happen. Okay, this guy's a problem. Okay, let's heal up here. stuff so we don't run into it later oh there's another plant what if we do this let's try this we have the we have unlimited ammo with this right so I'm not used to using this as a weapon oh it requires mana too shit okay <laughs> forgot about that Got him out of the way. The man it does slowly replenish. Alright, so which way do we go? Um, I have a feeling like we go this way, but I don't know that for sure. It's pure speculation. protect ourselves. No, that hurts. Regardless of the shield. Okay. So shield does not protect against the Screecher's uh, gobbledygook. Oh my god. Oh, that's the same. Ooh, can we sneak up on, on that one while it's on the ground? Whoops. I thought I had my healing spell on. I'm just gonna I just have to avoid the the things. Alright, let's um take one of those. Take one of those. Take one of those. Go back here. And heal up. All right, we're kind of running out of time. I hope we find a shroud flask pretty soon. Shit. Little bastards can really do a lot of damage when a bunch of them gang up on you. And here comes more. Just go away. What's that? Oh, mycelium. Okay, we're gonna need to find a flask soon, or we're gonna be in trouble. I don't have time to screw around. Let's just kill this thing.
Not seeing any flascas down here. It's flascas is is. There's the bad guy. Okay. Oh, there's two of them. Oh shit. All right. Well, it shouldn't be hard as long as we don't run out of arrows. Oh shit, there's a hole there. Okay, we got one down. Let's try and aim for the head so we can get... Is he bugged? Why isn't he moving? I don't know. But here, let's uh... Let's uh... Yeah, get this. Then we don't have to worry about the... Muck anymore. Whew! Okay, we're good. Man, oh man! What a deal. What a deal. Okay. Um, let's see what these guys dropped. Bow. Oh! Undergrowth Staff. 32 power. That is a major upgrade from what we're currently using. Oh, that's cool looking, man. Awesome. Okay. Very cool. And then we also got um, this. That's a level 17 epic ornate wood bow. Probably not going to be as good as what we have here. Um, might be better than the arsonist bow. Yeah, I don't know. I'll, I'll hang on to it for now, I guess. Okay, let's get rid of that. Salvage, salvage. Get rid of those. Uh, this we can salvage. Okay, yeah, that was a really nice staff. Um, now, let's look around for a moment since we have some breathing room now for a chest. And did we get a... Po oh, we got seven points. My goodness. Wow. Okay. Uh, we want good metabolism. Health mana and salmon orbs restore 30% instead of 10 of their respective resource. Mana and health potions restore 20% more. We'll take that. And then Sweet Tooth, the stamina regeneration of sweets is increased by 50% or more time in the shroud. Um, yeah, let's take Sweet Tooth and let's also do base stamina regeneration by 50%. Oh, no, I guess that cost four points. I thought it only costed one. This only costs one. Increase your dexterity after you bit by one. Okay, we're almost to desert stomach, guys. Or, sorry, desert stomach. <laughs> desert stomach. Desert. Desert stomach. Woot! Okay. We're doing good. Um, just curious if there is a... A chest somewhere. We were over here earlier. What are you shooting at? Oh, that guy. Oh, one of those dudes. Oh man, those guys are bastards. Okay. Um, let's get rid of him first so he's not causing us trouble while we're trying to fight this guy. This guy's tough. I'm afraid if I just shoot arrows at him, he's gonna... So I think what we need to do is just let him attack. And this is probably a one attack. Oh damn, I can almost get behind him. Oh shit! Wow. Okay. This is probably the toughest enemy I've encountered so far in this game. I kid you not. This guy is hard to kill, at least for me. 
you know, keeping in mind that I'm not a melee character, right? We're wearing squishy armor. Tricky. Ah, shit. Trying to learn how to read his movements. Nah. I tried to dodge past him. It didn't work so well. Okay. Stunned me. Yeah, see, he just puts his shield up. I can't, I can't range him at all. It just doesn't work. I'm trying to get a little stamina back here. Yeah, go in the hole, man. There you go. Mm. Ah, shit. Sometimes he hits twice, sometimes he hits once. Got him. That son of a bitch is tougher than the bosses, man. I mean, like, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Very hard for an archer character to kill. At least... At least for me. I don't know. Maybe, you know what, though? Now that I think about it... Maybe I should have been trying to get headshots off on him. Alright. Yeah, the next time we encounter that guy, I'm going to try and do headshots. I didn't... For whatever reason, I can't explain it. I didn't think to do that, and I should have. And maybe it doesn't do any good. Maybe his shield is going to block it anyway. I don't know. Okay, we get twice the time on our honeycomb now, which is great. Uh, well, 50% more time, I guess I should say. All right. We are sure spending a lot of time farting around down here. But it's kind of fun, though. <laughs> All right, there's another one of them flying banshee lady thingies. And my sword's just about ready to break, so we're going to have to go back to our mace. What's over here? Another banshee lady. Bugs. There's bugs over here. Hey, wait, didn't I just kill you? What the hell? What the hell? <laughs> Is that a spawner? Must be a spawner. Oh, it is. Okay. All right, let's just go. Ah. Oh, there's a chest. Okay. Ah. Get out of here. Oh, okay. Open. Executioner's axe. All right. We're just going to salvage that right off the bat. And let's blow that up because there's something to loot down there. Probably just uh, an enemy that we killed, maybe. Yeah. Oh, look at that. There's exploding barrels. Just too hard hard to see. Okay, well, we found a chest. Um, I don't know if, if that's the only chest or what, but you know what? With this spawner here, let's just get the hell out of here.
Um. So we need to go that way. Right? Yeah. When I get, um, when we get close to the quest site, I'm going to put down a flame altar. And then, um, uh, you know, go back home to repair and all that. I have two minutes left on Flask of the Fell. Yeah, if we can get on a road, we'll consume less stamina with our skills. Um, we want to go that way or this way. It's leading back the wrong direction. Pike's Port. Okay, so I think we can make this. Yep, Pike Mead's Reach. Shit ton of bugs over there. You know, I should probably... Whoops. In situations like that, it would be super handy to have a... have exploding arrows. Let's go up here. Hmm. Can we get higher? Whoa, shit. Okay, that works. We're out of the shroud for a, a moment. Wow, look at that place over there. There's a, a brute guy over that way. How many arrows do I have left? I have no arrows left. Seriously? <laughs> it's so hard to keep arrows in this game, man. Um, I mean, we could melee him, I suppose. I don't think it would be... I think we could handle that. What's over here, though? I really would like to put down a flame altar, though, before I do anything crazy. Just because it was kind of a pain in the ass to get here, you know? Okay, you guys are not too big of a threat. What? What the hell was that? Did he like spear me through the the mesh there? Oh hey look. Nice. What was that? Ah, uh, look at that man. Nice. An apprentice one. This is a level, uh, a level 15, 32 damage. Um, yeah, I think this is probably slightly, without shit, uh, better than what we have now. Alright, I need to... Didn't I just eat it? How did that wear out so fast? Alright, you're starting to piss me off, man. Oh, shit. We don't want to hit him over here. There's explosives. Come and find me out here. Did 
Ah, shit. I'm stuck. Stuck, 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 stuck. Okay, let's just go. Let's forget those guys. We don't need to kill them. I do want to kill that brood over there, but not until we get a, a thingy down. There's another chest way over there. Oh! You little bastard. Huckster Square. This town is huge. It's the, by far the largest town I've come across so far. Okay, we need to come up with three more pieces of stone. Looks like it might be. Can we pick any of these little stones up? What if we do this? I don't know if this gives you stone or not. Guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, it does. Okay. Only one piece. Seriously. What if we mine in the ground? There we go. Okay. Now we can make one of those. And let's put it. Let's try to find a reasonably safe place to put it. Hmm. Okay, I like this, um, I like this spot right here because there's no indication that there was ever anything, what the hell was that, ever anything dangerous that happened here. See, no indication whatsoever. Can we put this down? Oh man. Are you shitting me? Okay, we're probably gonna have to leave the city limits to put it down. I'm guessing. Unless there's something else that's blocking it. Yeah, it doesn't look like we can put it down here. Okay, so. Let's look at the map for a second. Yeah, this place is huge. And there's three quests for us to do here. There's a flame sanctum. Oh, that, yeah, that's where the kettle is. Should we just try and get the kettle? Um, I still would rather get a thingy down, though. You know, so we don't have to walk all the way back here again. So I think we really should try to do that first. And if I can get... Oh, look, there's a gold chest. If I can get outside, I can... Well, I can actually probably cut that tree down. Uh, I just need some twigs to make some arrows. Seriously. I do actually have some twigs, don't I? Oh my god, I had more twigs than I thought I did. Okay. What's in here? Archer chest. Alright, um... Let's go here. That gives us 24 stamina and 44 and 44. This is exactly the same thing. It just has a different look to it. It's the same level, same buffs and everything. Ooh. That kind of has a Robin Hood-ish look to it. Oh, 
Come on, these bugs just don't stop, man. Pain in the ass. Knock it off. Okay, let's see if we can get a few more twigs. Yeah, we got shroud wood anyway. Um, I'll read that stuff later. I wanna I wanna try and get this flame altar down. Okay, how many arrows do we have now? 55. Okay, that's something. How do we get out of this place? It looks like if we could get out over there. Oh, look at what we have here. Whoa. get rid of this thing. Uh, we do got a bad guy down there. Oh, it's him again. Okay. Let's see if we can get a headshot. I think we can. I think we can get headshots on him. Let's get the trash out of the way first here. Oh, shit. Oh, God, they keep coming. Is there a spawner around? Um, this isn't good. You know, if I could get them to go near the explosion thingy. Okay, let's get up here. Okay. Man. Sure, let's just kill the shroud, Rudy. Oh, no, don't do that. Kill the shroud, Rudy says. What could possibly go wrong? Huh? Okay, um... 21 arrows. That's not very many. I wonder if we could ninja down there and just chop it down really quick. That's pretty damn risky, man. But if we can get rid of that, it's going to help a lot. Let's replenish this. Let's take one of these. And one of these. And let's get back out of the shroud for a minute. And take one of these. Okay. This is probably going to kill me. No, he hit the fucking root. What? what the hell was that? Okay, I got a I got another idea. Lead all these bastards way over here and then we run back and ninja the root. 
Except for Mr. Spear guy, he likes to run. Okay. Chop it! Quick! Hurry! Fast! Do it! Now! Before I die! Oh shit! Hey, we, we got a few chops in. Alright, we can do this. We can we can absolutely do this. Oops. Don't do that. Okay. So uh Maybe we do the same tactic? Again? Let's draw everybody away. What are you doing? <laughs> I thought I had my axe out. Oh yes, we got it. Now we just gotta run. Yeah, baby. Woot! Okay. We got the root. Oh, and we're out of the shroud up here, too. Oh, this is good. And there's a flame thingamadoodle. Um, Alright, we don't need that elixir. Are they chasing us? Can we possibly put this down over here? See, I don't think it's going to let me put it in the city limits is the problem. <sighs> okay. I bet you we can go down here. There's a gold chest down there, too. Archer trousers. Hmm. How do those compare with what we got? They're actually... We don't get the plus two stam with them. Kind of interesting looking. Okay. Um, can I put the altar right here? I can. Good. Finally. Oh man, what a bunch of pain in the, pain in the butt. We're really close to the desert too. All right, let's go home. Get repaired. We'll come back and get this thing a doodle. This kettle. All right, we are back at Pike Mead's Reach. Um, I made 350. Well, I actually made 400 copper arrows, and then I turned. 50 of them into poison arrows. We'll give those a try and see how well they do. Um, we repaired everything, refreshed our food, made new potions. I was out of glow dust for that, but I made uh, a, f a couple more of those. And I think we're ready to to make this, uh, try this out again. So let's go back, I guess down here to the doorway. Shanty shacks. All right, let's just get you out of the way right now, and you too. Eh, you're a little too far away. The wand sure doesn't have very much range on it. I noticed. All right. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use up these wooden arrows for. These lesser enemies. There we go. Oh, okay. Hey, we got a level. Nice. Okay. And we should probably do this too. We have three points, and is that enough to get us? Please space damage regen. 
by four. Oh, that's a four point unlock. Okay. Yeah. Um, all right. I think I'm just going to sit on those then. So apparently just because it's a small circle doesn't mean it is cheaper. Um, all right, so we where are we going? We are going this way. We were apparently over here before. It's nice that the place has little pockets, you know, that uh, don't have the... Yeah, the shroud. We killed that root here. But only removed the shroud in this one specific area. Alright, let's just keep moving in the direction of the thingy. Oh, that's it! Nice! Okay. I was thinking we had to go further than that. Very nice. Okay. Man, there is a lot of stuff around here to explore. Um, and whatever this quest is and whatever this quest is, they're both kind of in the same area. We got both of those flame sanctums. All right, so... Um, we will definitely, definitely be coming back here, but I want to go home and get these new dishes made. So let's do it. And then we've got to wrap up this episode. We've gone long again, as usual. <laughs> some of you guys have said in the comments you like the long episodes. Um, and, I, you know, some people do, some don't. It's just it's the way it is. And I get it, you know, from both sides, too. All right, here we go. Kettle found. Praise the ancient, you got my kettle. How is Raoul? Oh, their time ran out as mine stood still. So we really are the last. How cold. Let's light a fire in their honor. Crafting a fireplace with that kettle will warm us right up. How do I know that Raoul is succumbed? I don't remember that. Uh, okay, so... Fireplace. Here we go. We got everything we need for it. Look at that. Boom. Uh, here it is right here. And I think for the mat, for the nonce, I'm going to put it here. Um, I, I, I know I've already said this a couple times, but I am planning on another building episode here pretty quickly. And, uh, yeah, so. Here we go. These are the, wait. Roasted. As, as your Rosilla, Rosilla? I guess that probably gives mana, right? So this is no different than what I can already do in the fireplace. Okay. But it does mean she can make this stuff for us now. So this gives plus seven stamina recharge. This gives plus three dexterity. So this takes the place of our honeycomb. This takes the place of our tomatoes. And this takes the place of our... Probably of our game. Plus five health, regeneration, and two endurance. Oh, no, no. We still want this, too, because this is constitution. This is this stuff will be stamina. Nice. Okay. So, I have 13 camel meal. Let's make seven of these, and I'll take the rest of the camel meal I have and plant some more. Uh, I got, yeah, I got a lot of this stuff, so let's make, oh, that gives us five per, okay, so let's make a, a 20 stack of that, and I'm really low on honey, too, but let's just turn all, uh, you know, that's easy to get, so we'll just turn all that into, into popcorn. Okay, so we'll put the popcorn there. 
This is a new stamina meal, which we didn't have before. And this takes the place of... No. This takes the place of the tomatoes, and this is the new stamina food here. Oh, man, that's going to help so much. fan freaking tastic Okay, guys. Well, we're going to wrap up this episode here. And um, in the next episode... What do we got going on? You know what? Let, why don't we go back to Pike Mead's Reach in the next episode? We'll get this wyvern head. Um, and then I've got to figure out how to get amber, and then we can upgrade the flame. And if we have time after that, maybe we'll do this too. We'll have to just see how it goes. But anyway, that is it for this episode. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys... I look kind of like Robin Hood, don't I? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you did... Please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and I'll catch y'all in the next episode. Ciao. I wish we had emotes.